friends, my name's Naomi. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today, as you can see, I'm in a different location and I am in a hotel room. I am currently in Louisville, Kentucky. And today, my boyfriend and I are hitting up some Kentucky bookstores. So I'm gonna bring you all along so you guys can see all of the cool bookstores here in Louisville. Okay. Stop number one is going to be Carmichael's Bookstore, Yeah. right? And we're also gonna go grab some coffee at, I already forgot the name of it. Hein Bros. Heinz, Heinz? No, Heinz. Heinz Brothers. Heinz Brothers, because I need coffee right now. And then we're gonna go to Carmichael's uh, Bookstore and I'm breaking my book buying ban and I'm gonna buy like 10 books. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Car Michael's books over. But first coffee. Where's coffee at though? Across the street. Cute. Coffee! Are we over here or? Well, I don't know. <laughs> I was just looking at that lavender honey latte. <laughs> what was it again? Stop it. What was no, what was the drink? You dumbass. <laughs> Very okay, Red thanks. Very thanks yeah, for your review. Nice. Okay, yeah. bye. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Gift shop. I can't believe they're playing the whole Taylor Swift Red album right now. <laughs> it's the best. It's the best bookstore experience of my life. <laughs> Show them your book. Oh. You might even. I know. Oh. Okay, it's haul time. You have just one, so just show them what it is. Just say the name and the author, that's it. <laughs> this belonging. Show, you have to show it though. You gotta do like the, oh. here you go. That's help, focused. Help. Belonging by, who is it by? Uh, Jeffrey L. Cohen. Yeah. Do you know what it is? Like a nonfiction, right? Yeah, it's. The science? Science of creating connection and bridging divides. Yeah, Stanford professor. <laughs> yeah. I got three books, and the first one is a fantasy book that just came out. It's in a series called The Foxglove King by Hannah Whitten. What this book's about, I don't know, but I keep seeing it everywhere, so I bought it. The next one is a mystery thriller book called What Lies in the Woods by Kate Alice Marshall. I know I've read something by this author before. Can't remember what it was, um, but this looks fun. And it had good ratings. <laughs> and the most exciting part is that I got a blind date with a book. So this says, young adult, graphic novel, queer main character, and pyromancy. Which we had to look up because I didn't know what it meant. And I guess it's like fire stuff. So yeah. I knew this is what it was going to be. Coven. I haven't read it. It's called Coven by Jennifer Dugan and Keith Seaton. I have seen this and I knew this is what it was going to be and I'm excited because I actually really wanted to read this so that's fun Yummy. That's the first good experience I have with blinded with the book Usually I'm disappointed <laughs> Okay, oh, we're not going to another bookstore today because the other bookstore has been closed since 2018 So we're going to bookstores on Thursday 
we're going to a bookstore that is all horror themed. It's called Butcher Cabin Books. And the other bookstore, I forgot what it was already. We were going to another one, right? Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot too. I don't know. Oh, Rosewater Books Rosewater. in Louisville. Louisville. If you're in the area. Okay, that's it. Louisville. Louisville. Bye. If I want it for what? For my Instagram? Let me see it. <laughs> Look at that. I'll use it for a reel or something. Fourth day, 30th. I know what I'm doing. Okay, first stop was Mickey's coffee shop. It wasn't like a bookstore, but they did have used books. I didn't buy anything. Um, I got a latte and you got a... Ice latte with mocha. Yes. It was really nice in there. And we're in Indiana. We're not in Kentucky. Mm -hmm. So that was the first stop. And now we're going to grab brunch. And then we're hitting up two more bookstores, which are Rosewater Books and the Butcher Cabin Bookstore, which is all horror books. And I'm excited to go to that one. Anything to add? Uh, no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> It's fun though. <laughs> With the butterfly. Stop number one. Butcher Cabby. Books. That's cool. There's vinyl, babe. Yeah. This, um. <laughs> Nicholas Cage. stopped at butcher cabin books it was cute very small um i bought two books so i got the weight of blood by tiffany d jackson and then i got such sharp teeth by rachel harrison i read cackle by rachel harrison and i really loved it and everyone was recommending this one to me so i bought it and now we are headed to the cultural gardens and then we're going to the last bookstore which is the rosewater books and that's that yum <laughs> Yeah, yeah. A DB. I should do 
like the fall at Naomi Cypher. Mm -hmm. I've read this, but I don't own it. It's like five bucks. What we got? City of Thrones. That was the door. Look. Alrighty, we just went to the last bookstore for our trip, which was called Rosewater Bookstore. It was definitely like more of a used bookstore. So, oh, that's me. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, anyway, yeah, it's definitely more of a used bookstore. There weren't a lot of new releases or anything like that. So it was a lot of like, it was a lot of backlist books is what I was trying to say um, I did get two books I've read both of them but I don't own them so I just figured I'd buy them and they were both like five books so I got City of Girls by Elizabeth Gilbert and then I got Cinder by Marissa Meyer and that's it yeah yep that's it for the vlog <laughs> hello this is editing Naomi on my standing desk about a couple days later from the trip. Um, I just realized that I never did an outro for this. So here's the outro. Thank you for watching. We had a lot of fun going to bookstores and visiting all the places in Kentucky. Um, I will say my favorite bookstore was Carmichael's. So if you're in the area in Louisville, go to Carmichael's bookstore. <laughs> um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.